Hey there, welcome to yet another video in this series. We are solving this question on a special request from Mr. Sanjay Tyagi. As you can see, he has categorically asked us to solve this question using our copy paste method. So let's take a shot at it. This is the question 9 from the year 2022 patent agent examination. We are provided with a disclosure and are asked to provide a title, couple of claims and abstract for the same. Why don't you pause the video, go through the disclosure and come back. Welcome back. Assuming you have gone through the disclosure and identified the relevant portions, let's get going. So the invention is about electronic mosquito racket with improved design. More specifically, the invention provides us with a shaft which is flexible. Let's get going with the title. Title is there in the first line itself. Electronic mosquito racket. This is your title. Let's move to the second requirement which is drafting a set of claims. As usual, we go towards the section of the disclosure which provides us with all details about the invention, the summary section. In this small disclosure, you can see that the second paragraph talks about the entire detail about the invention. See, it talks about a racket, having a frame body, a grip, a shaft, what all the frame body includes, how is the grip and how is the shaft. So this could provide us with the claim material. So we have an electronic mosquito racket. We have comprises, a frame body, a grip and a shaft. We can further define the frame by saying the frame body comprises two open frames arranged in a stack and an internal charged mesh set within the open frames. Moving to the second element, we can talk about the grip, that the grip is a hollow member for enabling the user to grasp with the hand. This could be ignored, you can maybe stop here. And then we can say wherein the grip houses a power control unit that includes a battery set and on off switch for controlling electrical connection between the battery set and the internal charged mesh of the frame body. Then we move to the last element which is the shaft. A shaft wherein a shaft is a flexible member made out of plastic and rubber carbon. This can go into dependent claims. So with this your independent claim is covered. I have provided a format for your ready reference. Let's move on to identifying the dependent claims. First is right there in front of us because they are talking about what it is made out of plastic, rubber, carbon fiber or any other suitable material we will not write because this is not definite. We need to provide definite examples. How do we start? The electronic mosquito racket as claimed in claim 1 wherein the shaft is made out of plastic, rubber or carbon fibers. Let's see anything else that is there. This one because the entire invention is about shaft. So the electronic mosquito racket as claimed in claim 1 wherein the shaft has a plurality of grooves extending around the periphery and spaced along the length of the shaft to enhance the flexibility of the shaft. This could be your another dependent claim. When you come down, you see what kind of structure that we are shown for. This diagram clearly mentioned that this is a flexible shaft. This is where they actually talk about how it actually increases, enhances the swiping speed, advantage of it causes the shaft to vibrate all this right. So this completes the claim section. Let's go to the last section which is the abstract. As always we go to the section of this document that provided us with summary and claim. In this small disclosure we know this is where we obtain the summary from and the claim from sorry. So we start with the invention provides an electronic mosquito racket which comprises a frame body, a grip and a shaft. You can include these details also in fact all these details you can include provided that we are left with enough words with us. This you should use because this is where the shaft properties are defined and if we are left with words 
we can use this information also that how the shaft being a flexible rod member provides advantages in the using of the invention. I have provided a sample abstract for you. We could do a lot with the information that is provided in terms of language but then as we promised that we are going to use the only copy paste method I have restricted myself to the words and sentences provided in this disclosure. I hope this reinforces the understanding that the information provided in the disclosure is good enough for us to take an attempt at title, summary, abstract and other sections of the patent application. So until next time, be good and take care.